Hi everyone, I hope you all are doing great in your life. In this video, I'm going to tell you about the latest hiring by IBM. So IBM is hiring in bulk for fresher. So anyone who has experience of zero to one years are welcome to join this hiring process because they are hiring in bulk. So there will be a lot more opportunity than you are looking for. And anyone who is genuinely interested will be sorted for the interview. So I hope you'd not miss this one because this is one such opportunity that comes very rarely. And for those who are, have certain amount of experience, like three to four years can also apply for the hiring on business analyst role and they can have a certain skill criteria as well there. So I'm going to tell you what exactly you need to know before you apply for this hiring. I hope you do not miss any part of this video because you will be missing out on certain information that you really needed to be heard. So I hope you do not do that. And the hiring is for the Pan India location. So anyone who is interested in the location of Pune, Hyderabad, Mumbai, Bangalore, New Delhi, Noida, Gurgaon, and yeah, so these are the certain uh, location that uh, where exactly this company is located at. So if you are selected for this particular company, you will have to go to the office and you will have to relocate. So even if you're uh, like looking for a remote opportunity, this is not the one that you're actually looking for. This is for the office roles. The skills that you need to, to know as a fresher is obviously the MS office application, PowerPoint, Excel, MS Word. So these are the certain application that you need to know. Outlook, if you have already certain amount of experience, you must be knowing certain application and you will be working on the cases and tracking the SLAs of cases. So this is somehow the kind of work that you're doing on this particular company. The role is for the process associate, which is uh, kind of great if you're a fresher and if you're just joining a uh, company of with such prestige. So I hope you do not miss this opportunity and I'm going to show you in my computer screen of how you exactly you can apply for this role and what is the exactly eligibility criteria. The basic minimum eligibility criteria is that you have to have any graduate degree and if you have that you can apply for this one obviously this is uh, one of one such opportunity that you may not miss out because of the fact that they are hiring in the mass the probability of getting selected in that obviously increases so I hope uh, everyone who watches my video gets the their dream job and fulfill their dreams yeah let's go back to my computer screen and see how you can apply here I'm on my computer screen and you can see this is the dashboard for LinkedIn my LinkedIn profile if you have not created any LinkedIn profile please go and do it and if you want to see See my profile and uh, like connect with me on LinkedIn. This is my profile, Somya Patak, Salesforce Analyst. You can search it out and you will find this one. Also, I have linked it in the description box so you can check that out. And if you have any query, you can connect with me on LinkedIn. So yeah, let's go to the job tab. So this is the job tab wherein you will be searching the companies that are solely there for the freshers role. And yeah. Here I am and I'm going to search IBM. So I have searched it out an hour prior and they have added 264 new jobs. So they are actually adding uh, jobs very rapidly. So you need to check that out. So this is the hiring like I have searched and I'm just op opening this one process associate order management. So I'm telling you that you don't have any prior experience. Uh, so you are just a fresher and you can apply for this one and if you don't have any direction just go ahead and do that because direction is something that you ultimately get uh, when you work on something and when you start something so I believe in that ideology and if you feel uh, like me so go ahead and apply for this one the your primary responsibility will include coordinate activity uh, associated with order management there must be certain application wherein you will be like tracking the orders and everything uh, so this is the uh, this is the opportunity in healthcare. If you really want to become a healthcare data analyst after that, you can also do that once you have certain ex amount of experience in healthcare. So this is uh, how I can uh, like uh, tell you for your future purposes. Uh, how you can start in the analyst industry as well uh, having certain amount of experience but before that you can you have to join it so this is the way so yes uh, then the second uh, skill that you have to have is primary responsibility is something that you recognize potential threat and suggest suitable action that you will be trained on adhere to slas that is service level agreements and times so there would be certain cases when in which you have to like be uh, like cautious of the timelines given to you you have to close the certain kind of cases you have to be uh, like track the cases and uh, keep it in, in progress and close it as as soon as possible so there will be certain timelines that should not be exceeded and then if you go over here the technical and professional expertise that you should have is graduate with zero to one years of experience or in a healthcare domain it depends if you have the experience and if you don't have it just you're just a fresher who has a zero amount of experience okay so that does not matter ability to handle queries through calls and email follow-ups 
so that you need to be like trained on readiness to work in shift as needed for the job strong communication skill uh, abilities with fluencies that develops over time no need to worry on that the technical uh, and professional expertise is that you have to have uh, proficiency in ms office application as i've already told self directed and ambitious achiever so all of these like this is for the google gram location these uh, like 4000 posts that they have given is for this role only very rarely they have like uh, given a role for someone who has certain amount of experience if you go over here this is process associate order management again for the google gram role uh, location next you will find the same uh, thing for the pune location as well as hyderabad as well as uh, for the uh, bangalore so this is showing me the gurugram location because i have like certain they, they show you the certain proximity for me the gurugram location is the nearest so similarly if you are in like chennai you, they will show you the job uh, for the chennai location okay so why i am saying that you should apply only eight people clicked on apply you have to click on this button right here and you will be redirected to their uh, career portal over here and then you have to like uh, fill in all your details on the IBM career portal here you can see and apply just that please make sure you create a good resume so that the, uh, your resume gets shortlisted immediately and if you have any referral please go for it because referral actually matters and uh, anyone who is hiring they always look for the, uh, the the application that came from referral so that actually matters do not miss out on that similarly there are roles for the reporting analyst and i know you are genuinely someone who is wanting to become an analyst but i am telling you that this is a way if you just enter into somewhere I, you will find your own way i am not someone who can tell you exactly everything but i can tell you as per my four years of experience that this th this is a thing that actually works people uh, keep on applying and keep on just looking for a analyst role then they actually don't get it once they have one to two years of experience everybody hires them so i hope you gather certain amount of experience and fake your experience and just get into the it uh, it analyst role so this is the reporting analyst role and you can see uh, the the roles and responsibility over here and I, I find it really great that if someone is actually into analysis like once i was so they will find these kind of hirings really good for them they will feel it so if you see over here the, your roles and responsibility would include develop and maintain regular ad hoc reports to support business needs once you have worked on the support kind of roles such as process associate which i already told you this is something that will be a, like piece of cake for you it's just sim simple for you so analyze data to identify trends patterns and anomalies collaborate with cross functional team here as well you don't have to have certain amount of experience if you generally want to uh, apply for the uh, this role you can also do that as well okay so there are roles for freshers there are roles for someone who has certain amount of experience such as this business analyst role would definitely have like you have to have a 5 years of prior experience so if you have that experience from the pet process associate role you can apply for this one okay so yeah this was it for this video i hope you found this video helpful if you have any query suggestion or doubt related to this hiring i'm gonna actually tell you how you can apply for it and how actually you can do it you can dm me personally on uh, linkedin or as well as you can connect with me on my instagram naming techie somya okay so yeah bye bye for now until we meet next time